Hi, my name is Alona Ross, and I live in Kingston. Um, I really support the addition of new housing. And it would be wonderful if the Kingstonian project were to deliver what it promises to deliver. However, it will not. The parking is an exercise in new math and has been designed to fool a lot of people. That's why the planning board admitted, although they didn't use the language, that there was not enough parking, that they're going to have to build more spots near Dutch Village. Because, in fact, if you look at the code, the parking is not only going to not add, add available spots. If you follow the code, it's going to take away. It's going to It's going to take away spots. That's why, that's why at the planning board meeting, um, they they refused. They did not want to use the language. Oh my God, we're going to have to add more spots. But they did discuss the need for more spots over by Dutch Village, which is more than a thousand feet away. Um, as far as bringing in new businesses, I, I'm really looking forward to any study that will show me that create that creating apartments brings in businesses. Usually people follow the businesses, and I would love it if this county and this city put their effort into organic business creation instead, instead of, cre of allowing a $52 million project where the develop that is in an opportunity zone where the developers will never have to pay capital gains tax in another 10 years. As far as, as, far as the MUOD law, Absolutely. The, the fact that this council is, is sending out trial balloons, turning the law on its head to indicate that because we have so much affordable housing in Kingston, therefore we can do market rate housing, that is, that is an absolute travesty of the law as it stands. And that should not be, that should never cross any councilman's lips. That is a travesty. As far as the secret goes, there is a need for a hard look in Secra. Not only has the planning board and this city council not given the hard look that is required under the laws of New York State, but you have turned a blind eye to the, to the objections that have been raised about affordable housing, about green construction, that's another thing, the whole green construction thing. You've, there have been letters asking for green construction. The response that the developers gave is another, another travesty where they endeavor to, to consider green housing. Come on, it, no, I, I'm sorry, I, I get very upset. We do need housing, but we don't need a project that's built on lies. Thank you.